In my mind, there are three things that set apart the Monk School from other schools. One is that we study global affairs and public policy together. Yes, they're separate degree programs. We've got lots of interaction between our students. We've got faculty who teach across the programs. And across the board, if you look at any pressing issue globally today, those issues have domestic policy implications and they have global implications. So if you really want to be an effective public actor, I think you have to recognize that the line between what happens outside of countries and what happens inside of countries is, is increasingly blurred. So we give students an opportunity to learn public policy in the context of a global affairs school and learn global affairs in the context of public policy. The second thing that sets the Monk School apart is that it sits within the University of Toronto. The Times Higher Education put out their ranking in the fall of 2022. And it told us three things about the University of Toronto. We're among the best public universities in the world, the second best in North America, according to their ranking. We're the best university in Canada. And we have more excellence in breadth than any other university in the world. Monk sits at the center of that university, so it gives us the chance to be the nexus through which all this knowledge and all this activity, when it implicates public policy and global affairs, all of it flows through us. And the third thing that sets us apart is that we're central to the policy conversation in Canada and globally. We're a place where policy actors, political leaders, public servants come to ask us what are the questions we should be asking about in the world today. We help them find the answers and we check their work once they bring those answers back to us. So to be a student here is to be involved in a global conversation with people who are coming through the school, with the research projects that faculty members are conducting all over the world, and with those conversations that we're having outside the school about how we should be kind of tackling the biggest challenges in global affairs and public policy. My first time actually being at Monk was 15 years old or 16 years old and I joined the Global Ideas Institute program. When I was given the challenge of that program, it was the first time that I was actually able to feel that I could do something tangible. And at that age of 16, I actually told myself, this is where I want to go. I remember going to an event last March or April and it was right at the beginning of the Russian invasion of Ukraine. And there was a great deal of uncertainty. There were so many questions about what it was going to mean for the world, what was going to happen next, and what it meant for us here in Canada in particular. And in the midst of this global crisis, unprecedented since the Second World War, the Minister of Foreign Affairs dropped by the Monk School to talk to students for two hours. And I think it, it just sort of brought home the fact that this is one of those places where these conversations happen, where sort of the people who are forming the next chapter of our country's history deliver the, the ideas and share the ideas and hear back from people about how those ideas are going to play out in practice. I think it's a really cool place to be. This is a place where our best students take their work seriously and they dig in in their courses but they recognize that there's all this other stuff that happens at Monk in a way that it doesn't at any other place. That we've got dozens of people coming through in a month, all of whom will change your life if you listen to them. That you've got wonderful classmates who you're gonna to wanna to work together with inside but also outside of the classroom. And you can do it all in a city that really represents, I think, the future of what democratic societies are gonna look like. Vibrant, dynamic, ambitious, multicultural, and democratic. To be the version of myself that my younger self didn't ever expect. And I think that's what the Monk School has been to me.